appreciation wasn't my fault. How am I going to explain it to Dad? He's going to freak! My name's Willie Beamish, and this is where it all starts. Carbuncle Elementary School in good old East Frumpton, my hometown. Baldo, I mean Principal Frick, is blabbing on and on. Hey, it's the last day of school. Get a clue, Frickmeister. Yeah, right. Like you think we were going to listen to anything. Hey, a kid's got to get his breath. Ribbit. But not good old Horny. He's my pet frog and best friend in the world. He makes a leap at the old Cooch Coupe and totally nabs it. An incredible leap. is, he hops right back to me like a good frog. We'd secretly been planning this for weeks. But then I totally get nabbed and put in detention. So bogus! On the last day of school! Now here I sit with that old hag nag Miss Glass, Miss Broken Glass, Glass Nose, pain in the... Black. And with all these total losers. Man, I'm so bored I can't stand it.
Willie Beamish? What did I just say? Oh no, the old broom caught me. Better think of something fast. I don't... I don't know, Miss Glass. I said, it's a beautiful sunny day! Your friends are outdoors having fun! The birds are singing and your report cards <laughs> are in today's mail! Oh man, that C I got in music appreciation wasn't my fault! How am I gonna explain it to Dad? She's gonna freak! Won't your parents be surprised when they see your report cards? <laughs> if Mom and Dad see my report cards, they'll never give me the dough I need to get to the Nintari Championships this summer. Too bad you have to stay after school. What you did this morning was disgraceful, Willie. Just disgraceful. And in front of all those students. Ms. Glass, I'm supposed to be in juvenile court today. May I be excused? You didn't raise your hand! Nice try, Carmine. Stop talking to your neighbor, Chubby! Ribbit. Do you have something you wish to share with us, Willie? <laughs> You're in for it now, Willie. No, Miss. Jelly donut? My mom gave me extras. What a bunch of losers. I gotta get out of here. Now, people, I want you to write a composition. It will be called How I Plan to Spend My Summer Vacation. G.I. Jim Dog Tag Chain, having long since lost the tags bearing his name, rank, and serial number, Willie carries this chain because he thinks it looks cool. Yo-Yo, a Duncan Chromaster Elite Model 42. This particular one was used by Oregon State champion stringer Jerry Luttrell. Autograph he inscribed upon it has enhanced the value of the yo-yo by about 12 cents.
Frick's hair. An extremely poor example of a toupee. Some muskrat somewhere is missing a patch of fur. Game Buddy. Perfect for those dull classroom lectures. Well, if it isn't Willie Beamish, you little monster, long time no see. Long time no hair. What are you here for this time, Beamish? Just had to say adios before I blow out of here for the summer. You're not going anywhere, Beamish. Not until you give me back my, you know, my hair. Here, Mr. Frick, is this thing on the endangered species list? If you don't watch it, Beamish, you'll be on the endangered species list. Give it to me now and get back to detention. Get back to detention. Hey, Beamy, what are you doing out here in the hall?
Just on my way to the bathroom, coach. Let me see your hall pass. You little crumb! This hall pass is phonier in a three-dollar bill. I'm sure Mr. Frick will be interested in discussing the penalty for forgery in Carbuncle School with you. So you thought you could get away with lying to Coach Belt, eh, William? You disrupted assembly this morning and you humiliated me in front of my students? What do you have to say for yourself? Sorry, Mr. Frick. You ever have one of those days, sir? All right, Beamish, get back to detention now. And Beamish, try to stay out of trouble this summer. What do you want now, Beamish? I'm tired of seeing you out in the hall. I was just on my way to the bathroom, coach. Let me see your hall pass. Uh, I don't have time to look for a coach. I really gotta go bad. I don't care if your back teeth are floating, Beamish. Rules is rules, and you gotta have a hall pass. You can tell your sob story to Mr. Frick. You have an attitude problem, young man. What you need is some good old-fashioned discipline. Military school, that's where you belong. Mr. Beamish, I'm sorry to tell you, but... William doesn't meet the standards of Carbuncle School. Yes, I would send him off to military school at once. It'll do the little fellow a world of good.
Willie Beamish? What did I just say? Oh no, the old room caught me. Better think of something fast. I don't know, Miss Glass. I said... I said... It's a beautiful... I said... I said... Oh, man, that... Won't your parents be surprised when they... If Mom and Dad see my report card, they'll never give me the dough I need to get to the Nintari Championships this summer. have to stay after school. What you did this morning was disgraceful, Willie. Just disgraceful. And in front of all those students. Ms. Glass, I'm supposed to be in juvenile court today. May I be excused? You didn't raise your hand. Nice try, Carmine. <laughs> oh, that was just my frog, Horny. What did you call me? Uh, it's my frog. Yeah, he needs to stretch his leg. He's real cute. Wanna see him? No, I don't! at Carbuncle School. Well, if it isn't Willie Beamish, you little monster. Long time no see. Long time no hair. What are you here for this time, Beamish? Just had to say adios before I blow out of here for the summer. You're not going anywhere, Beamish. Not until you give me back my... You know, my hair. Chill out, Egghead. You know what they say, hair today, gone tomorrow. That's the last straw, Beamish. I'm sick and tired of your behavior. It's time you learned a lesson you'll never forget. Mr. Beamish, I'm sorry to tell you, but William doesn't meet the standards of Carbuncle School. Yes, I would send him off to military school that once. It'll do the little fellow a world of good.
Will he beat it? Oh no, the old broom caught me. I've got something stuck in my ear. Uh, could you repeat that? I said, it's a beautiful sunny day! Oh man, that C I got in music appreciation wasn't my fault. How am I going to explain it to Dad? He's going to freak! Won't you? If Mom and Dad see my report card, they'll never give me the dough I need to get to the Nintari Championships this summer. Too bad you have to stay after school! What you did this morning was disgraceful, Willie! Just disgraceful! Ms. Glass! Nice try, Carmine. Stop talking to your neighbor, Chubby! Ribbit. Do you have something you wish to share with us, Willie? <laughs> You're in for it now, Willie. No, Miss Glass. That's better! Hey, Willie, want a jelly donut? My mom gave me extra... What a bunch of lo... Now be... Hey, Beamish, what are you doing out here in the hall? I was just on my way to the bathroom, Coach. Let me see your hall pass. This hall pass looks mighty peculiar, Beamish. I guess it's a new one. You can go now. Ew! Ah, oh, this place smells gross! Yo! 
Look what the cat drug in. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble now. What are you doing here? Just my luck. If I'm not careful, this guy's gonna really bust my chops. Hey, what you got in the backpack? Something a Spider-Man wants? I care. Don't you know smoking is harmful to your health? So is this, dirtbag. What happened to you? It's my mouth, nurse. Well, I was in the bathroom, minding my own business, when these two big guys with baseball bats, maybe it was three, came out of nowhere and... What a little trooper you are. Now just sit still and let me take a look at you. Now hold still while I make sure it's nothing serious. like my jaw might be broken. You're going to be just fine. For a moment there, I thought we'd have to send you home early. It's just a little swollen, that's all. You can go back to your class now, Willie. What do you want now, Beamish? I'm tired of seeing you out in the hall. School's out and I'm history, Coach. Have a nice day! All right, Beamish. Pump out one last set of push-ups for me.
Go now, coach. Let me see your hall pass. out of trouble this summer. Now get. All I gotta do is hang onto my report card for a while, and I'll be on easy street. I assume you're going to show that report card to your parents, Willie. Of course I will, Grandpa. By the way, where have you been hiding? I haven't seen you in a while. haven't needed me for a while. You've got to watch yourself, boy. Something foul is afoot in the city of Frumpton. Duffy? How you doing, boy? Hiya, bud. Maybe I should take him for a walk. and grits, cables and grits. I'm going to get me some cables and grits.
Like, you won't believe what happened today? Like, I heard Trish say that you know who did you know what with you know who? Oh, God, like, so call me as soon as you get home, okay? This is Mr. Frick from Carbuncle Elementary School. We've been having some discipline problems with your son, Willie, again, Mr. calling to see if you wanted to go see the Gums and Noses concert with me Friday night. Call me when you get a chance. There are no messages. Thank you. Nothing like a little Nintari action. I haven't played for at least eight hours.
too early to go to bed now. I think I'll play a little longer. Ready to go to bed now? I think I'll play a little longer. Jar with flies, just the thing for a hungry frog. Chance like this doesn't come along very often. Tiffany's gonna freak the next time she weighs herself. Diary. Tiffany's innermost private, but admittedly not very deep thoughts are recorded here. think you should take your sister's diary, Willie. I guess you're right, Grandpa. There's a small inscription on the toilet which reads, If you sprinkle when you tinkle, be a sweetie and wipe the seedy. Willie, I need some help in the kitchen.
How was your last day of school, dear? Great, Mom. Just great. I'm glad you're home. I'm up to my ears and I really need your help. Brianna, you'll just have to wait. Willie, you can unwind after you help me. Brianna's been whining all afternoon. Get her out of my hair before I go crazy. Just take her into the backyard for a while. No way, Mom! Brianna's a real pain! Then grab that Jinsu knife over there and julienne those veggies for dinner. No can do. I gotta practice with Atari. You know the championships are coming up. And I need all the practice I can get. Ma! You promised me that Willie would take me outside to play! Brianna, I'm starting to lose my patience. Now just be quiet or else. 